Doctor? Uh, hey. Hey, Janet, I brought Christmas cookies. I'm on a cleanse. Hey, Nathan. There's Christmas cookies in the break room if you want one. Yeah, no, right. On the phone. Sorry. Sorry, I'm gonna have to call you back. What? Did you get the invitation to Mr. Shepard's Christmas party? Of course not. Well, I did. I just got the email asking me to RSVP. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> right. Let me see. That's weird. Why? Because I got an invite and you didn't? No. Because Mr. Shepard's basically been MIA since his wife's accident. What? What happened? Word on the street is that after their hunting expedition in Antarctica or somewhere, Mrs. Shepard basically came back a vegetable. What? I don't know, maybe she's better now. All I know is this guest list is a who's who of lamb core. If I were you, I wouldn't miss it. So glad you could make it. Come in. <laughs> I don't know what to bring. Oh, no, this is fine. May I take your coat? Oh, thank you. I'll be right back. <laughs> Am I early? No. No, you're right on time. Lana. Hello, Mrs. Shepard. It's so nice to meet you. Darling, please. Call me Camilla. Thank you. You're welcome. So, where is everyone? Everyone? For the Christmas party. We prefer more intimate gatherings, dear. We find it's the most effective way to get to know someone. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mr. Shepard? Uh, yes, Benjamin? Dinner is served, sir. Excellent, we'll be right in. Well, shall we? He says to me, oh, no, 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 that is not my wife, that is my sister. <laughs> that's my sister. I said to Camilla, that's the last time we go to an after-hours club in Buenos Aires, right? 
So, uh, Lana, tell us, where's home? Mm. Well, I'm just your average Midwestern girl. Hmm. And um, what brought you all the way out here? Uh, well, since I was a kid, I've always dreamed about living in the big city. Hmm. And after my parents passed, I thought, there's really nothing tying me down. Life's too short, you know? If you know what you want, you gotta go for it. Well, I'll drink to that. <laughs> ah, yes, Benjamin, thank you. My pleasure, madam. Speaking of Buenos Aires, have you ever been? No, oh, I've always wanted to. Fascinating city, just beautiful. You know, they lived under oppression for so long, so now it's very free. Oh, that's good. You've ruined everything. No, 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 it's okay. It's just water. Is, is there a bathroom that maybe I can... Yes, it's just down the hall to the left. Thank you. startle you. Just thought you might be lost. This house is so big, you might not find your way out. Yes. Thank you. Hmm. Well, come, the night is young. <clears throat> So, Lana, what were you doing? I'm sorry? Before you came to LAMCOR, what were you doing? Oh, I was working at an internet startup. And before that? Well, I, that was my first job out of college, so... And before that? Um... What was your first memory? <laughs> I don't know. No one's ever asked me that question before. Mm. Well, I remember mine. It was... Benjamin! Please, Gatherings, take it out of her. She needs a rest. Benjamin, take Mrs. Shepard to our sleeping quarters and see that she's made comfortable. No. It's all right, honey. It'll be fine. Get your rest. Uh. Well. <clears throat> Thank you so much for dinner. I, I really hope Mrs. Shepard gets better soon. You're not leaving just yet, are you? I really should get going. Dinner was wonderful, though. Stay for a nightcap, at least. I have this very rare Macallan, distilled in 1926, aged in oak barrels. Only 40 bottles ever produced. And I have the last one. <laughs> so, what shall we toast to? Uh, to good health. Yes, to good health indeed. Mm. I think it's about time we stop beating around the bush, don't you? I don't know what you mean. Oh, I think you do. No, no sir, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Lana. Stop with the lies. You've come into my home and lied to me, lied to me all evening. What? Yes. I think it's time we find out exactly what you are.
up! <laughs> Lana, Lana, Lana. We both knew it was going to end this way. As you know, Camilla and I have been collectors for many years. In the beginning, it was the hunt for the most exotic animals. It was intoxicating. But then we were introduced to a whole new world of collecting. A very secret, very elite society of people who hunt extraterrestrials. Once we tasted that, there was no going back. But eventually, our lust for the otherworldly caught up to us. We flew a little too close to the flame, and Camilla suffered the consequences of our hubris. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> what do you want from me? <laughs> Lana, still pretending. Even though Camilla was paralyzed, we had heard there was a cure. It was believed that the blood of a certain species of extraterrestrial contained healing properties. But unlike these useless beasts, this alien resides in plain sight among us. What? We were able to track down and capture one. And the rumors were true. Camilla slowly began to recover day by day. Our lives were getting back to normal. But then suddenly, she started to rapidly decline. We needed more of its blood. Unfortunately, we had drained the creature dry. So we began the hunt again. Which brings us to you. Mr. Shepard, I don't know what you think I am. Well, in five minutes, We'll know one way or the other. Excuse me, Mr. Shepard. What? It's Mrs. Shepard, sir. Something's wrong. Fine, I'll be right there. Don't you try anything. Much time. Oh. Thank you so much. He's insane. Come on, here, put this on quickly. Quickly. We have to hurry. Where do you think you're going? We're still waiting on your results. Please, don't do this. This is all you're doing. You lied on your resume. You lied. You lied about your job history. You lied about your family. Your entire history is a lie. None of it is real. Tell me what you are. Please don't. Say it! I knew it.
the end of your message, press 1. <laughs> Lana, hey, I uh, still don't have the, uh, <laughs> the reports for the budget meeting. Lana, 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 where are you? <laughs> Lana, hey. <clears throat> you do good for me now? Go to one Christmas party and you're, uh, well, you're better than us? I'm just wondering, where are you? Did you like run away? Lana, sorry. But I'm good. Lana, hey. So we didn't get the budget passed. I got fired. Did you get a better job? Did you? Lana! I am so mad at you. Right. You know what? Goodbye.